Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about how to create ODBC data source for Postgre SQL or add here connecting to a Postgre data based with ODBC. So add here first uh, in Google write ODBC driver for Postgre. So first we need to download and install the driver. So write in Google and hereafter you need to select this site. Okay, Postgre SQL ODBC driver 32 64 bit for Windows, Mac and Linux. So click this site. Now here after the next is here you can find ODBC driver for Postgre here. So this is for 30 days free trial after that you need to buy. So click this download button. Now here you can find this is for Windows and here if you scroll down this is for, for add here Linux and here if you scroll down so here you can find this is for mac os so i'm using uh, windows operating system so here i'm going to download this one so at here click on download so at here the file size 14.8 mv now here click on save the file is downloading so this software that I already downloaded, so I'm not going to download once again. And here after, let's go to download. And here, this is the dev art ODBC. Click this exe file. Now here after, now here this is the ODBC driver for PostKey set of wizard. Click on next. Here accept here next so this location where driver is going to install next here so it must be selected now here click next and here this is for I'm going to use for trial and here after click on install so this is extracting the file and installing so it's done add here now here after let's go to control panel so in search box write control panel so control panel now here after system security and here add administrative tool now here after double click on ODBC data source and here after this is the already created add here ODBC now here after click on add so since I just installed dev art ODBC driver for Postgre, you need to select this option and here after click on finish and here after the important thing so DSN give any meaning full name so giving add here ODBC for Postgre now here description it's optional and here server name that is so uh, add here local host or you can give the your PC name so going to write add here local host now user ID so at the time of installation of Postgre you have created a user ID so and they that ask about to uh, a password so if you if you have confusion just write PC admin so right here PZ admin it's a opening the PZ admin it's open now here after click on server so add your server it's now it's a opening here you can find Postgre SQL so whatever version you uh, install you need to click there now here after here so if you scroll down here you can find the uh, add your login group roles okay if I click this here so this is at here user postgres and at the time of installation you have set the password and here the pass oh, here after the database if you go on the database so this is at your inside database the name is postgres now here let's give the username that is postgres and here give the password and data name also the same so a schema that is not required so if all done correct here after click on test connection so connection successful now here after click on ok 
and here you can see ODVC for post key it's uh, created after that you can use this ODVC in anywhere like Power BI or Informatica or anywhere this ODVC okay so this is the way we can create ODVC connection with post key SQL so I hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video